if Heron Foods is the cheapest supermarket in the UK. We've not even got inside. This is looking promising. Mummy, you're not going to be happy about this. What do we do? Jojo, Jojo stop yeah. jumping. Calm down. No! <laughs> she can't handle this. <laughs> What's happening, Free Game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From Newport in Wales. Yes, that's right. We are here for another van life video. How are you guys doing? Let us know in the comments below. Any of you Welsh Free Gang there, let us know. Or wherever you are in the world, we love hearing from you. So let us know in the comments below. We're really excited because today we have another awesome shopping video. Yes, after our recent video in Farm Foods where we were checking out to see if it was the UK's cheapest supermarket. We were bombarded with comments from you guys saying that we should check out Heron Foods, as in fact, Heron Foods could actually be the cheapest. However, there was a bit of a problem. We could not find a Heron Foods in London. Yeah, they seem to be all outside of London. And so we realized that if we were going to find one, we would have to find one on our travels. And we're now on those travels. And they just happen to have a Heron Foods right here in Newport in Wales. And so that is where we are going to be going to today. Yes, to discover if Heron Foods is actually the cheapest supermarket in the UK. Right, shall we head there now then? Let's do this. That's really good already. Like, we don't really drink these, but that's a really good Come price. and check this out then. Ooh. 150 for a box of Magnums. Let's hope the vegan ones are that price as well. Yeah, and also, if it's a hot day, we can get them and eat them straight away. Yeah. Wow, meal deals as well they do. We've not even got inside. This is looking promising. And it does say, top quality, lowest prices. Right. Let's see. We've literally just come in here and all of, they've got so many good offers as soon as you walk in. Look at that. That's that's better than like Rogers. It's better than Rogers. 29p for being vegan mayonnaise. We love this one, don't we, JJ? It's mm -hmm. got to be done. Yeah, we got a trolley. As you remember, when we went to Farm Foods, we got a basket first, then regretted it and had to get a trolley. So we just started off with a trolley this time. We're learning. What is the flavour? marmite. That's the thing. And that's a good price, right? They're normally over three quid that size. £2.50 for truffle flavoured marmite. That is amazing. Is it is it being done? We've got to get some. Hot crisps. Only 79p. You'd be paying like 150 for a bag that size. Yeah. Least. True. We're running low on snacks in the van, so it's got to be done. Got Maybe get two. Two? Sure? Yeah, they're quite nice, they're popped as well. What you found there, Jojo? I found popcorn. Popcorn. Where have we, we where have we got this from before? We got I found it in home bargains. And and what's it like for price? It's normally £2.39. So it's ah. a bit more expensive, but that's still good. I yeah, think. what you found. You found the first freezer, you got excited. That's really good. We got vegan sausages. And they're a pound. They're only a pound, yeah. Cumberland style sausages. I don't think we've ever had those ones before either. Veggie power. Broccoli and buckwheat. That would be nice for um the stir fry, fry, isn't it? Mm. Oh, I've just realised though we're kind of limited because we're in the van, we can only get so much frozen stuff, or it has to be eaten tonight. Yeah, we can get these to eat tonight. I mean a pound each, you can't leave them there for that. She's gonna be saying that again all day, isn't she? Should I get one or two of these? Well, are we gonna eat them all tonight? We'll just, eat well, just get how one. How hungry are you guys? We'll just get one then. I've done these, we had these years and years ago in America. They're, they're, in America they're called Twinkies. And they have them here? Yeah, but they're just called something different, but it's the same thing. Right, I didn't and know you had them here. 29p or five for a pound. So that'd be 20p. Yeah, I'm not going to buy them because I don't think they're vegan. Oh, that's good as well for popcorn. Three for a pound. Oh, right. I thought they were like Pop-Tarts, but you just put them in the microwave, didn't you? Yeah, we don't have one in the van though, so we can't do that. No but they've got so many good prices on all of these snacks. It's tempting me to get very snack-tacular. You know, sometimes driving, just need to eat as you go. No. Ritz crackers would be perfect. They're only £1.25, do you want to get them? See what Jojo thinks, Ritz crackers. I approve. He approves, okay, go. 
Look what I found. Oh my goodness, what have you found? Oatsly chocolate fudge ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no, it's a pound. <gasps> no way. You think about when we've got like Ben and Jerry's. I know it's a different brand, but this is a big vegan brand. We were excited when one. it was two pounds, yeah, weren't we? Yeah, it's a pound. However, problem. We can't store it, so we'd have to eat it straight away. We can eat it straight away. <laughs> you seem confident. Yeah, leave it in the freezer. We'll come back for it. Just pour it. Like otherwise, it'll be a pool of liquid. Yeah. Wow, that's really. I'll just have to check that. It is actually a pound. Oh, look at this. 33p for these. Those guys, they're not vegan, but that's still good. I don't think good. so, yeah. And pizza. Look, look as well. Pizzas, £1.79p. Nice. Mm -hmm. We must remember it. Remember that pot of I'll ice cream. I'll remember it. I'll remember it. What if we find the vegan muffins as well? We'll get both. Yeah, we'll get both. We'll get both. Have we got any um, good breakfast cereals? This is interesting. Remember we saw the pots in Far Foods and they were like 150 or something? They were more expensive, weren't yeah, they? Yeah, these are like 59p or 50p if you do two for a pound. So okay. yeah, that's a really good offer, isn't it? That is. So if we compare that to how Farm Foods it was over, it's price, wasn't it? So maybe this yeah. could be cheaper. Any other cereals? I swear we've got these loads recently. Yeah, we should know how much they are, but I can't remember. <laughs> 500 grams of oats, 79p. Mm, cheaper right. in Tesco's. All right, come down. <laughs> okay, so this place is similar oh, to oh, oh. Farm Foods because they've got lots of freezers and then they've got oh, the all, stuff up top, all yeah. the stuff up top as well. So we've got to keep our eyes open and lots of snacks. Yeah, right. Lots of snacks. Jojo? The elusive prawn cocktail, what's it? Do you want any snacks, Jojo? We need to get some snacks, I feel. We just need to. We need to get some <laughs> need, snacks. Yeah. yeah, we need. Well, Can you just. Prawn cocktail boxes? Go on then. Did we get them in here? We didn't, did we? Uh, no, we didn't. So, what you guys found? We found these thingies. <laughs> they actually are called thingies. So, they're a pound for. How many are you in here? Nine packs. Nine packs. Three each, one each of each flavour for us. There's 11 packs on that one. Huh? <gasps> Nine packs is the one pound, though. What do we do? <laughs> but if it's 11 packs, so we won't be able to evenly share. This All way right. we can have one of each flavour. Okay, put it in the trolley. Yeah. What we got here, four pound or two for seven on all these pizzas and ready meals. Three for nine. That's pretty good. This is going to be really hard because there could be loads of amazing frozen stuff, but we can't get it because we've got the van. But then again, we've got lunch and dinner today, mm. haven't we? So we could do two meals worth, couldn't Maybe. we? Maybe. Some of these might be handy. That's good. That 89p, that's good. These might be handy for the van. Mm. You can get a couple of those if you want, 89p. Get two brown basmati, because that'll go with anything. What you yeah. found there? Pasta? Yeah. yeah, I think this is a brand, isn't it? Delicia Italiana. It looks like it anyway. It looks like a good brand. Um, uh, mm, I wonder if they had their own store brand here. You know, like Farm Foods had some. They did have some. But I think 89p, but it's cheaper if you get store brands yeah. at other places. Most pasta tastes the same, doesn't it? Wherever I've you go. I never know the difference between any brand. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, absolutely. What is that? It's, it's, the, it's Passata with basil. Napolina again. Yeah, three for a pound. I think we got six for a pound. Yeah. At Farm Foods. I've nearly used them all already. Should we get three for a pound of these? Or oh, maybe get a bag of pasta we as do. well then. Yeah, should we get some pasta as well? Which one should I get then? Fusilline. Yeah. They're all the same price. Sometimes, normally spaghetti is cheaper, right? Yeah. What have you got? So. I've just realised this does, makes no sense whatsoever. Six crump crumpets for one pound ten, but then nine crumpets for a pound. Mummy, come on, explain. Um, get the nine ones. Do you no, no, no. But why is that cheaper? Why I is don't that ten? Know. Come on, answer. You know this stuff. I don't, like, how is that even? Make, maybe they've done it around the wrong way. No, no it, it says, says it. Nine pack oh, on yeah. the it does say it. label, yeah. and then six on there. Just bear with us a minute, guys, while we get over this, okay? Do you want them? Of course. Right. It, 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 it's it's a, a must-have. Like crumpets, a must-have. We can put the marmite on them. Mm -hmm. I'm really questioning Jojo's category of must-haves and needs in this challenge. We're also just wondering if the bread is any cheaper. So, what's the cheapest loaf? Normal size loaf. I think we've been getting them for about £1.40 for like the Warburton's type one. Yeah, any brandy one, it was like King's Mill before, wasn't it? Yeah, this this is £1.65. Yeah, and look, oh, this one. It it's looks nice though. Braces, it's one thirty. That looks nice though, it's ti like tiger bread. Oh yeah, I've got to get that too. See, this is what I mean. He wasn't here on the last challenge. He's making it worse. 
Mm. No, it's not a baby, put it in the trolley. I'm wondering. What are you wondering? I've seen this brand XL. They do just like plain packaging. Oh, and okay. Then you can get like potato wedges. Got potato wedges. A whole kilogram for 175. But yeah, it might be their own brand, just like plain packaging. Hmm. What have you found? These beers. That's the only thing you jump that way to, isn't it? What are we saying, Jojo? They Sorry. look good. What price are they? They're 130. That's, that's actually kind of expensive for you to do them. <gasps> no! Oat milk. Wait, oh, look. That's like product of the day. This oat milk. But to be honest, even if you don't get it for the offer, 39p hey, for one. We have to keep checking to know if this is actually true. It's definitely that. It's true. It's actually true. Should we get three? I don't know. Should we get one? Can we keep them chilled that many in the van? It's, it's pretty cool down in the... Mm, but we're getting warm weather now. Maybe just do one for now at 39p. You can't, you can't leave it there for that. You really can't leave it there for that. Well, we won't then. Tofu. Three for a pound for tofu. That's, that's silk and tofu. Oh, or oh, there's firm. Get the firm. I reckon, one. yeah, they get the firm. Oh, oh no, because we can make scrambled. Have okay. you got black salt and have you got turmeric? I've got. I can. I can still make it work. I, I can make it work. Or just get the firm stuff and then we'll put it in with that uh, buckwheat mixture. These oh. have to be refrigerated. Maybe. Once open, keep refrigerated. I might get some taken home. Okay. That's really good. Forty nine p or three for a pound. It's amazing. Why don't we get three of each? Three firm. Three silken. Yeah, they're both three. But he's he's grown for it already. Also, in the same section, forty nine p. Oh, but nice. Yeah. And Coco, that's a good brand as well for vegan dairy stuff. That's really good. Are you grabbing it? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I've just seen something. Jojo's seen it. I've tracked down the vegan magnums. Oh my goodness. But they're not for 150 like the offer. How much? They're for a pound. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> she can't handle this. Can't she, handle she can't it. handle it. Normally we... more than a pound for just one. Yeah, but shouldn't we save it to the end like the oats are late, Or we pick one or the other. No, no, no. Save it, until, Save the it until the end. Because ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. we're going to eat these straight away. Right, anyway, right. back to the yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> Poor old yogurt got upstaged by the discovery of one pound of vegan I'm magnums. So oh, vegetarian vegan. Ooh. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> Jojo, Jojo stop jumping. Calm down. Listen, guys, we have to remember that she's sm smashing things out of the way. We have to remember we have no freezer in the van. We can't get too excited. Or maybe we can. Listen, lunch and dinner. Just have a feast. Look, I guess what we have to think of, if something is frozen and we want to save it for dinner or lunch today, then it might just get defrosted and most of the cooking will be done by the time we get to it. Yeah, they've got some really good offers anyway. Vegan sausage rolls. They've got the Linda McCartney ones. Cooplands, I've never heard of those before. So never. that'd be 150 a box, is that? Well, no, that's the Linda McCartney ones. These ones. Oh, okay. So they're £1.50 a box. Six of those. Two for three pounds. And so, these ones are 179 Okay. I never so, tried these ones though. No, nah, maybe it's time, Katie. Maybe it's time. What else we got here? We got, oh, so we got these ones before. So they're £1.50 here. Yeah, you can get for one thirty nine at um, Farm Foods. Farm food. So, okay. Is it farm? No, it's one pound twenty five at Farm Foods. I think so, it's yeah. cheaper than that. Anyway. And also got some mash, onion rings, other oh, veg bags. Oh, they've got some good veg, veg, veggie bags over here. Mummy, you're not going to be happy about this. What? What's the problem? These pot noodles. Oh. How much are they? Let's just get her away from here. They're one pound nineteen for the small ones. Although it is two for two pounds, but then the big ones are one thirty nine. Yeah, the other day you got them for a pound. Club card, didn't you? Yeah. But that's good. I mean, two, two for two pounds. Not bad. You're okay. Not bad. You're I'm right. Okay, I'm okay. This is really good. All of this frozen veg is a pound. Well, it's one nineteen, but three to, for three pounds. It's kind of handy in a way that we don't have a freezer because we'd be filling up right now. We've got to remember as well the stuff up the top here. So tin stuff, that can be handy. 
if we find some good soups or something like that. Yeah, well they've got these soups are all four for five pounds. So that works out one pound twenty-five each. And these are three for three pounds, these so, this other brand. I like these ones as well, minestrone, that's vegan, is it? Tomato and basil probably is. Um, so yeah, we've options. Also, let's not overlook as well the other brands of pot noodle. Can you just call them their proper names then? Non-pot noodle noodle pots. Or these ones, which you get five in a pack of these super noodles, which are only 125 and you get... And the amount is probably the same as a pot noodle, right? No, 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 more. You get 300 grams in this. You only get 75 grams in a... No, no, but they're 60 grams each, that's the thing. That's what I'm saying, each individual pack. Yeah, and then you get five all together. Yeah. So maybe let's just go for something like this. They, they'll be nice in the van, won't they? I've just seen these um, vegan bakes on here. That's oh, that's the same, the same brand, brand as, the... as that part. They don't have them in there. Are we doing sausage rolls or any of this stuff? Or do you feel like we're hitting our limits on frozen at the moment? Well, I don't know how I would cook the sausage rolls as well because, or heat them up. Because heat I could them through. Put them in a pan. I haven't got a lid. I need another lid for my pan. Why don't we just put it out in the sun and then it'll be done soon? Good idea? No? Ooh. These are good. How do you pronounce that word? Chasseur. Chasseur. It's a seasoning, yeah. Three for a pound. Oh, four for a pound for those ones. Be handy to take home, wouldn't they? Because they're light as well to take in the van. Yes. Oh, I think these are vegan. Oh, the garlic We've bread. got them before, haven't we? Yeah, but we're not getting them now. Sorry, frozen stuff. We're not even halfway around the store yet. So. But we're well over halfway through the trolley. The trolley. You've got so much stuff. No right. joke, what's going on? The hard thing is, it's, we can't really do chips in the van, can we? Jojo's getting so excited, I'm glad we didn't take you to farm food with us. Because you wouldn't have been able to contain yourself. Hey, you were bad enough. Beans comparison, what are we saying? Oh, Beans. so this is? These, they're cheaper, they're cheaper in Poundland. Poundland, okay. leading away. Uh, £2.39 in Poundland. Oh, so stuff like tinned veg is going to be helpful for us, isn't it? In the van? Yeah, I don't know how. I think if you were to go to a Tesco's and get like store brand, I think that would be cheaper. Yeah, 75p a tin. Yeah. That seems pretty pricey. Yeah, they've got obviously similar to farm foods where they have a whole aisle of potato y, frozen potato y things. We've got to respect that people that dedicate that much I space know. to potatoes. potatoes. Yeah. Okay, you guys have found a good deal on beans. Beans, better price beans, which are these ones. Yeah, because on their own, they work at 75p each if you do the two for 150 offer. But this one it works at about 62p each. So it's better. Okay, we, we get, get four of those in? Yeah, get four of those. Go get are... them beans. <laughs> That's too much. That's too much. <laughs> they got more fresh stuff over here as well. Yeah. Down here, look. Oh, salad pots. Ooh. That's what we can do with. Yeah, how much are they? So they work out. 120 for one of those. Not brilliant, but should we get a couple of these anyway? Because we always are yeah, get a couple it. of those. What are we coming to here? We're just looking at desserts. I know we found some great stuff already. But it's interesting that the magnums aren't vegan. But they're offered two pound a box. Oh, okay. Only we had a freezer. We'd fill up on a pound box, wouldn't we? Oh, they've got Ben and Jerry's as well. What's that? Two for six. Um, oh. What you found? The good old jam. <laughs> oh, the good old jam. What size is it though? That's how you getting another one. No, no, no. Oh. I was just comparing. That's how you know that was a good price because that was that was two fifty. Yeah. These these ones are three twenty nine. The original ones. So that's really that's how I know it's good. They're exactly the same size as well. They've got some really good offers on drinks. We don't tend to drink anything like this, but they've got some amazing offers. Five for two pounds. Forty two pounds. Yeah. A lot of maths going on here. Yeah. So I think we are mostly done here now. We've yes. gone around everywhere. However, we need to grab the one important thing. We've made the decision. Is it going to be the Oatly tub or is it going to be the vegan magnums? And we've decided the vegan magnums, right? Yeah. 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 So that's the last thing we we'll get. And then we're into the van and it will show you the whole haul. And see how much we spent as well. I'm really interested to see how much we spent on this. There's been no tracking going on whatsoever. Also, I'm sorry, that's just unreal three of them I had to check three of them for one pound do you know what's crazy to buy one of these on their own in a shop is about two pound fifty I know and then you get a three for a pound and they're cheaper than any others okay we're all done let's go and check it out 
and let's go. Here we go, guys. Our first ever haul at Heron Foods. I know. What did you think of the place, Mummy? I mean, I really liked it in there. The staff were lovely. Really helpful. I did like their accents, though. Yeah, but that's not specific to Heron Foods. That's because <laughs> we're in Newport, Wales. No, but they were just really friendly. It was really clean in there, really nice. Interesting fact, apparently, this is supplied by the same people who do B&M. Apparently, some of the food comes from there. Yes, someone just came over and told us that. So that was really interesting. So anything B&M has that's surplus. And yeah, that surplus gets put a lesser price here. Yes. So it means it gets used. If we were at home, I probably would have bought so much more. It's a good thing we weren't at home then. Yes because like they had so many good offers in the freezer section. Well, and they you, had good offers everywhere, fresh stuff. And you saw what happened at Farm Foods. Yeah. You just about got it in the freezer. In general, I was quite impressed. There were some shock moments of prices of certain things. Of course, the standout one, the vegan Magnums, which have gone already because it's a hot day and they would just melt and so it had to be done, guys. Please yeah. forgive us. That's an empty box. Just for honesty reasons, I'm just telling you that's an empty box. Yeah. We've got meals for tonight, we've got meals for tomorrow, we've got we've got meals for the whole weekend probably. We've got a really good spread of stuff. We've got some fresh stuff in salad and easy peelers. There the, wasn't much in the way of fresh veg. The tofu, man. The tofu, the tofu is normally like- 50 a pod. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes you get it for 189, but three for a pound? I mean, I like, I got genuinely excited about that one. You got excited about a lot. Yeah. Jojo got excited. He's, he's just chilling in the front now, calming himself down. <laughs> yeah, we've got bread. I think the bread, that was probably more expensive for bread. That was just average. But no, that was a spe that's a speciality one, Tiger Bloomer. Their, you know, wholemeal or white was yeah. about 130. How much was that Al Alpro that again? Was three, that was 39p on its own or three for a pound. Come on, guys. You know how Come much. Come on, guys. You know how much Alpro is normally. Two pounds normally. Yeah. I got excited when we got Alpro for a pound in Poundland. That was nothing. But, but Heron Foods has really raised the bar now. I would say, again similar to other places we visited if you can shop around go to heron foods and get their bargains get I'm... your vegan magnums and your tofu from here for sure well the, anything they've got on offer go there and if you're able to shop around some people aren't able but yeah. if you have one in your area and then you have like a farm foods in your area go to heron foods get their bargains then go to farm foods get their bargains it seemed like their best prices were with what we might consider speciality stuff so for vegan stuff Good prices on the sausages, the broccoli and buckwheat, the tofu, the mm. vegan magnums, the yogurt. Yeah. All of those good prices, but your general everyday staples, pasta, bread, stuff like that, wasn't anything different, I would say. Yeah. I, I wish we had one closer because I would love to <laughs> I would love to do a like um can we get our weekly shop there? That would be really interesting for under 30 pounds. That would like I would love to do that challenge there. But yeah, these nap these sauces is where you can't see there's a lot of stuff back here as well. These sauces were like they were like three for a pound as well, yeah, weren't they? Not as good as farm foods, but still very good. Yeah, so can you believe look how big this receipt is? And we only spent, I mean, you normally you have a receipt this size and you expect it to be like, I don't know. 40, 50. 50, 60 pounds maybe. Okay, you're not gonna believe this guys. 26.87. When that happened, I thought there was something wrong with the till. I like thought- There was a mistake, like, no, that's not he right. He said to the lady, are you sure? Like, have you, have you scanned everything? Pretty yeah. amazing, like, thank you so much guys for recommending this place. Yeah. Because I'll be honest, when I first saw the recommendations, I looked online and I wasn't sure if it would be that cheap, but blown away by some of their stuff. So thank you again, guys. You're full yes. of good recommendations. Yeah. The so question is though, is it the UK's cheapest? If we could figure out a way to put it up against farm foods. Yeah, this particular store wasn't huge as well. I, no. I, I can imagine there being bigger ones as With well. With more products available, yeah. Yeah, but it could, it could it's in the running for definitely being the cheapest supermarket in the UK, I would say. So yeah, let us know guys, if you'd like to see in the future us put up Heron Foods against another place, if we're able to figure out how to do that, or considering that there's none near our house. But yeah, let, your, let us know in the comments below. But that's where we're going to end this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate you tuning in. And we will see you all in the next video. Just remember, though, guys, no matter where you are in the world, always stay free. And just keep rising.